In this video, we're going to talk about Premier Blue. Premier Blue is trying to make options on chain easy for everyone. I'm going to explain that also in a minute, showing you the app. But the biggest news here is that they just launched version three. They've been building since 2021. They had the, the first two versions uh, in the past years, and now they just launched version three, which is pretty cool. And we're going to go and have a look at that. So this is Premium Blue, Premium.Blue. Uh, you will find also the link down below. Uh, so they have a different features for trading options and they try to explain as much as possible so it's definitely good for beginners but they have also some of the strategies that are more advanced and uh, basically for for more advanced users that do know options do know the risks that are uh, affiliated with the with options so it's both for the beginners and more advanced traders. So uh, this is the, the Premier Blue website. You have different academy explaining basic option strategies, what you can do. Uh, you, they have different pa partners within the, within the community. They primarily are on Arbitrum. This is where the uh, V3 version is launched, but they have also a bunch of other chains coming through. And we're going to have a look at uh, the, the app themselves. You can click on open app directly on the website or just go directly with the link down below that you can find uh, and then you'll be taken here. So this is where you can choose one of the chains. As you can see, you have uh, Arbitrum. This is for V3, but th there's also other chains, uh, Ethereum, Optimus, Phantom Opera and Arbitrum Girly testnet. Uh, for now, Arbitrum is the only chain for V3. This is in beta. More chains are coming along the way. So Let's explain uh, how options actually work if you especially never traded options. So first of all, the easiest thing is uh, you can actually just use the vault. The vault is the easiest thing because you don't have to understand anything. You just uh, commit some of the capital uh, and they do all the trading for you and they have short vol volatility uh, volatility vaults for uh, wrapped ETH, uh, for Arbitrum tokens and for wrapped Bitcoin. Basically, it's about selling covered options to earn premiums by shortening volatility. What that means is basically you have uh, options plus some kind of a perp, a perpetual contract. Usually you have to do everything manually. They use their own algorithms to actually do that here uh, when it makes sense. And they explain it. Ev uh, they explain everything here, what they're trying to do. So by depositing collateral into the vault, you will receive vault share tokens that can be later redeemed. Uh, and basically this is uh, about underwriting options. So uh, the underwriting vault participates in one main algorithmic activity, selling options for premiums plus a spread on holding till expiration. Uh, because when you sell uh, a, a put option, then basically you uh, get the money right away. Uh, and this is, uh, and, th and you can use that money to, for example, open the, uh, open the, the uh, some kind of a pair position. So this is basically how you uh, how you can do it yourself manually on other uh, other protocols but basically they do it here for you and you can just uh, use the use the vault now if you want to trade uh, the simplest thing is uh, using the uh, strike price for so for example you will have to choose one of the assets they have wrapped it if uh, wrapped btc and arbitrum but basically uh, the way it works you, you put a, a strike price which means that the current price is for example uh, $1,592, right? And I'm, uh, I want to bet that Ethereum will go over 1,700. This is my bet and this will happen uh, within the next week or so. So this is the expiration. I have the expiration for 22nd September. Uh, so eight days, 22 hours from now and I can put the, the size. And then I will have a bunch of the quotes for this kind of option and they explain everything that I can do. So for example, I have the total cost here. Uh, I will have uh, the break even. So what will have to be the price to actually for me to break even uh, and so on. So especially that makes sense if you think that there will be a lot of volatility. The price will change significantly. This is an easy way to actually bet. Uh, it's often cheaper than going with perps because uh, so other option is that if you believe that Ethereum will reach the price $1,700 within the next week or so, then other option would be uh, buying um, 
and basically just longing and putting some leverage. But uh, if you do that, then there is a funding rate and you will have to pay for holding this kind of long for for long position for uh, for for this amount of time. And often options are cheaper uh, cheaper options for for uh, betting on the rise or the decrease. Uh, of the price uh, because if you buy a put then basically you're uh, saying that the price will be below a certain amount so for example you can uh, you can say that uh, within the week the price will be still below uh, 1600 and you can get a quote on that uh, so this is like another option you can also sell options it's a little bit more complicated so selling call is a little bit like buying a put and selling a put is a little bit like buying a, a, a call, but this is uh, the huge difference is that once you sell, so it's, you short it, uh, it's basically uh, you have infinite risk to the position. It's a little bit complicated, but people are doing that because once you start selling puts and, for example, buying different perps, then basically what you're basically doing is you're betting on volatility and this is what vaults are doing for you. So you could do it here uh, by hand, but basically uh, it might be easier to just do, do do use the vault now you have also a bunch of other options so the uh, outside of uh, outside of strategy vaults you also have range orders uh, a little bit more complicated you can read about them in the documentation uh, you have of course your portfolio and there are different staking options so premia has their own tokens the the own reward tokens uh, that they're using uh, so you can stake it here to earn more rewards and have different boots. So different the boosts. Uh, so this is basically how Premia works right now. Uh, really cool thing. Uh, I think we definitely need more derivatives on chain, which are easy to use for people to jump in and also explains. And this is what Premia is doing. So not only they have different options for trading options, but uh, they also try to provide this academy, uh, teaching you about different stuff. Uh, you, if you want, you can go directly to documentation and see a bunch of concepts. They try to explain different uh, strategies for trading options. So if you're new to the game, uh, you definitely should check it out, uh, even if you decide not to trade options in the end, because of course this is risky and you should understand what you're doing. Nothing here is financial advice, of course, but definitely check it out and check out the, document, the documentation for different educational purposes. Thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel and see you in the next video.